Hello guys, so how to turn two-factor authentication on Slack? So if your password is compromised or stolen, you will have a peace of mind. Basically because it's just another layer of security and especially if you have a, like important workspace with like uh, hundreds or maybe thousands of uh, members, maybe it's, yeah, it's a good idea to enable two-factor authentication to boost your security. So first of all, you will need a, a authentication app. That's what I use. And that's for iPhone, you will need like Google Authenticator, or the same for Android and for Windows Phone, Microsoft Authenticator. Or you can just use SMS text message. But I would just suggest for you to download this app. Then you need to go to your Slack account here using this link. So, and then just follow these steps. So let's just try it out. So here I am in the Slack account and I can just uh, yeah, go here and click set up to factor authentication. First of all, you will need to confirm your password. After that, you need to select either an app or a SMS text message. So let's just use an app. So as you can see here, I just need to take the app and scan this barcode via app and then just enter verification code. After that, I will just need to enter a barcode from the app. Click verified code and activate. And then you will need to add a backup phone number. It's, uh, yeah, you can skip that, but it's, uh, yeah. And after that, you will see that your 2FA is enabled for Slack. And after that, you will see this uh, backup codes, which you will need to save somewhere and don't show it to anyone. So you can just copy these codes or just like print these codes and save them. So yeah, that's basically, that's it. And here's guys how Authenticator app looks like on iPhone. So I just go to this app and in the very bottom, as you can see here, here is Slack, your email and then your codes, which are like auto generated every short period of time. And then you will just need to enter them every time you log in to Slack. So thanks for watching and please subscribe to this channel for more everyday software videos.